My heart is just racing right now. It's already turned up. <laughs> I'm gonna be a mess today. Megan and Thomas were getting close to being engaged. I started thinking about my wedding dress in a box in my closet with probably a little layer of dust on top of it. And I thought, you know, none of my kids are gonna wanna carry this around forever. So I thought, let's take it out of the box. And I knew Megan wasn't going to wear it, but I thought, let's make something special out of the dress. So we made her robe for getting ready on wedding day and it has some really pretty ruffles. And we made the um, ring bearer pillow and it's our grandson, Forrest, that's going to be carrying that. And it just ties both of our weddings together. Megan, I just want you to know that you have been an amazing daughter and you are a absolutely beautiful bride and the man you are marrying is totally the right person for you. You two are just a wonderful couple and I love you so much and wish you and Thomas a lifetime of happiness. Megan, you are the pride and joy of my life. I know that you're going to be so happy with Thomas, and I can't wait for you guys to start your life together. Love you, babe. Love you too, Thomas. Oh my God. You look beautiful. Uh. For you, it, it's a quote from John Steinbeck it says, A boy becomes a man when a man is needed. Megan, for you, John Steinbeck also says that if you find yourself in a fair fight, your tactics are horrible. So, that being said, I love both of you. I look forward to the many years that we'll all have together and look forward to the next generation as it comes. Love you. Go ahead. Yep. Oh, you look awesome. <laughs> <laughs>
I promise to take you, Megan. To be my wife. To be my wife. I promise to be faithful to you. I promise to be faithful to you. In good times and in bad. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love you and to honor you. To love you and to honor you. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. I Megan take you, Thomas. I Megan take you, Thomas. To be my husband. To be my husband. I promise to be faithful to you. I promise to be faithful to you. In good times and in bad. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love you and to honor you. To love you and to honor you. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. Stupid jokes, both of us wishing we were old right then, 'cause we knew it was love. And everybody says take it slow, but I think it's true. At the end of the day, all a best friend wants for their best friend is to find a partner that makes them feel safe and loved. I'd say Thomas, you've accomplished that and so much more. You two make a great team, rooted in faith, strong enough to deal with whatever the future may throw at you two. I always told Megan to marry someone who felt like her best friend. Thomas, I truly couldn't pick a better guy for my best friend to end up with. So, I often think about all the other streets the cruises could have moved to in Gretna back in 2002. I'm just eternally grateful that they settled on Hampton Circle because I think God not only knew we both needed a best friend, but a sister as well. I'm with you. It all makes sense. I finally get what they all meant by falling in love with your best friend. Yeah, I know they probably think I'm crazy, but I don't care. None of it can phase me. Yeah, we could be dancing all night, waking up for the sunrise. Seriousness, Thomas has brought some really great guys into my life. Megan, I absolutely have, love having you in our family, and you could not mesh any better. You have truly treated me like a brother, and I cannot appreciate that enough. Although you did steal a person I typically go 50/50 on every meal with, I couldn't be happier that you're a comrade. Although I mentioned my favorite year is the one I get to spend with you guys. I still really look forward to seeing you guys unfold together as you move to Des Moines. So, can we get one more round of applause for the couple, as well as how beautiful Megan looks in her dress tonight? As it's a nice change of pace since you typically wear the pants in the relationship. 